Hello, everyone. Welcome to Cook Stacy Cook. Today we are making char siu. Char siu is Cantonese glazed barbecue pork. I finalized on this recipe after years of trial and error. I think today's recipe offers the best combination of taste, color, and texture. Let's get started. First, let's prepare the marinade for the pork. We will start by beating two eggs. The eggs will make the finished char siu more tender and flavorful. Then we add six cloves of garlic, finely minced, and three shallots, finely minced. Then add some sugar, salt, sesame sauce, two pieces of red fermented bean curd, some regular soy sauce, five spice powder, rice wine, and red yeast rice powder. I made the powder by grinding red yeast rice. Red yeast rice is a natural color traditionally used in cha siu. Mix everything well. I use pork shoulder to make cha siu. Cut them to about 1 inch thick. This thickness is important in this recipe because when it's too thin, the finished cha siu will be dry. Prepare the pork by patting it dry. Place the pork and marinate into a large Ziploc bag. Squeeze out the air and make sure all the pork are covered with marinade. Let it marinate for one hour. Meanwhile, let's prepare the glaze. Traditionally, the glaze is made with maltos. In my experience, maltos is better than honey because it gives the cha siu a slightly crispy glaze. You can find maltos in many Asian supermarkets or on Amazon. Steam the maltos until it starts to melt. Then add sugar, a little bit of water, some salt, and two slices of ginger. Continue to steam the glaze until the maltose completely melts. Turn off the heat now and cover the pot to keep it warm. After marinating for one hour, Place the pork in a baking sheet. Preheat the oven to 536 degrees Fahrenheit or 280 degrees Celsius. Place the pork on a higher rack in the oven. I use the second highest rack in mine. Let it broil for 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, take them out of the oven and flip them. Then back into the oven for 10 more minutes. After a total of 25 minutes of broiling, the char siu looks like this. There is always a bit of burnt edges. This is normal. Let the char siu cool down until it's warm but not hot to touch. And we are ready to put on the glaze. At this time, set the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit or 180 degrees Celsius. Transfer the char siu on a clean baking sheet. I am saving one of the pieces for tomorrow. More on that later. Stir out the glaze first and apply it generously and evenly to the char siu. Make sure to coat all sides. Then put the glazed char siu back into the oven for 15 minutes at the lower temperature. 
For the piece I am saving for tomorrow, I will keep it in the fridge for now. It's completely cooked. When I prepare dinner tomorrow, I will apply the glaze and broil it for 15 minutes, like we just did. This way, I will get to enjoy char siu fresh from the oven. Back to the glazed char siu. Remove them from the oven after 15 minutes. Quickly apply another coat of glaze and allow them to cool. I usually let them cool for 15 minutes before I cut them. After 15 minutes, cut them into slices. I am very happy with this char siu today. Look at how juicy it is. The color looks good. It's juicy inside and slightly crispy on the outside. The taste is very authentic. This is simply perfect. I hope you will give this recipe a try. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe if you find this video useful. And I will see you next time.